my brothers and sisters in Christ, and welcome to that fastest 30 minutes in broadcast. Well, hey, I'm Prophet Johnson. We're going to get started. Now, I'd like to apologize for the Friday night message because many of you are like, rah, 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 we missed Friday night. Bum, bum, bum. Well, the Friday night message will uh, be played immediately after this message, okay? <laughs> so, supposed to be. So uh, if you don't catch it tonight, then you catch it tomorrow night, but you should be able to catch the um, Friday night message right after uh, tonight. But we're going to go ahead and get started because we have got to endure tests and trials and temptation. We must have respect for others. We must be a doer of the word, not just a hearer of the word. We must also begin to operate in the prayer of faith the power of the word of God being sent forth, okay? <clears throat> Excuse me, let's get started. Uh, uh, James chapter number one, uh, we, we, you'll probably see James chapter number two because that's going to be our key area there, but we're going to look at James chapter number one, and then we're going to go to chapter number two, okay? Look at what it declares in James chapter number one, and in verse uh, number 12, James 1 and 12, the very first word says bless, which means uh, 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 there's a prerequisite here, bless. So God is saying you are blessed already if prerequisite is the man that endured temptation. So listen to this, brothers and sisters in Christ. You are blessed just for going through hell and high water. Why do they call it hell and high water? Why not hell and low water? I guess high water got to drown you. But I don't know where that comes from either. But you are blessed once you endure it. Temptation. Which means you have been tested, you have been tried, but you are also more than a conqueror. You are overcomer. We are the overcomer. We are the chosen ones. For when he is tried, time to separate. We're climaxing on this week, y'all. For when he is tried, tested, he shall receive the crown of life. So God is saying that the apostle let us know that I reckon that the sufferings of this present time is not worthy to be compared with the glory, the all-inclusive essence of God that shall be revealed into us. Eyes have not seen, ears have not heard, neither have entered into the hearts of man the things that God have prepared for us. But it is revealed through his son, the word, Jesus Christ. A crown of life which the Lord hath promised to them that love him. Every living strong viewer, you, yeah, it's, it's still here again, you, even though it's cool, you love God. That's right. Every living strong viewer, you love God. God have blessed you with the crown of life. Why do you say every living strong? Because there's no way you can watch this if you don't love God. Even the haters that watch this love God. The devils that want to see you fall that watch this love God. They may hate you, but you cannot watch this broadcast without loving God. Why? Because of all the hell that you done went through. Because of the level of word that, come, that comes forth. Because the truth tells us straight down the line. We don't have to get into all of the deep pigmentation of the skins of life. To deal with the level of truth. That is foundational and basic. Enduring test. Time to separate. And um, which which the Lord have promised to them that love him. Everybody don't love God. Don't you know that the, um, 
the elitist, I'm not going to get into this. Let me just say, only he that let it will let until he be taken out of the way. There's an element of forces that are evil, that are waiting to come in and to destroy the world. Christianity, the power of Jesus, the blood of Jesus, through the power of the Holy Spirit, is holding back the end time prophecy to where the people that are set to devour flesh, to destroy man. We're not getting into that. I'm st Listen, folks. Through the mark of the beast and the antichrist, we're not getting into all that. In AI, we're not messing with that. Nephilims, Nephilims. The CERN, the portals, they're even showing you on your Disney Channel. Sonic Boom, the Hedgehog. I mean, how they got the ring. Portals, the abyss coming open. Revelation 13, the black hole phenomena. The entrance gate, star gate. And you know what's so strange? Is that they're showing this stuff and feeding it to your children. The descendants, Red Rising, Nickelodeon, SpongeBob, Mr. Crab. It's all about money and wealth, fame and fortune. And if you look, minister, the strangest thing, man. Brother, you got to hear me on this. Because living strong viewers are not listening to me. I have told them secretly and have not revealed nothing. Because I'm not out for your internet sensations. But I said, God. I said, even the children, when you look, and I'm, and I'm like, where did this come from? Because I am old-fashioned, ancient, behind on the times, Fred Flintstone, a biscuit eater, mutt, shot to the core, just a dough bread, gingerbread boy, running to keep from being ate up. <clears throat> but here's the thing. When you look at that Sonic Hedgehog dude, dude in this speed, whatever, going through these portals and just a cartoon movie or whatever, but then you see him go and stand and talk to who said the owl. I was blown because I'm thinking, how did they get away with this? And I've been telling living strong viewers the whole time that who set the owl, the black cat, and the secret satanic order of government. I've been telling y'all this for 30 years, people. They run this show. Congress, the people that you see don't run nothing. Okay? They run nothing, folks. So you best set yourselves because these portals and dimensions are really being opened. And the time of fire and glory is coming back to the church. The prayer, hallelujah, that the priest prayed. Solomon, and they could not enter in because the glory of the Lord, hallelujah, engulfed that place. Another level of warfare, another level of glory, another level of spiritual ingenuity and activation must 
will and shall take place in God's elect and in God's elite. Who said the owl and the black cat? Y'all have no idea. To me, it's not worth talking about. It's not worth mixing. I'm the old foundation. We're going to be on our way out of here, us baby boomers and gen exorcists, but I don't know. Because they got technology for everything now. While they're killing some, they're giving life to others. Where am I at? Trying to put on two pair of glasses. That's what I'm doing. Here it is. Um, let's look at this. He shall receive the crown of life. We're in James chapter number 1, and we got to go to chapter number 2, and we're in verse number 12. Which the Lord hath promised to them that love him, let no man say when he is tempted, I am tempted of God. For God cannot be tempted with evil, neither tempt he any man. So, when we think of tempted... We think of the testing. So God will allow testing, but it is Satan that does the tempting. You see, so it says and declares, but every man is tempted. Watch this which is a allowable God testing when he is drawn away of his own lust and enticed. Now, the first thing you think of when you think of lust is some fleshly na nature of a male and a female. Oh God, I wish that was just it. The lust is the desire of anything based upon the fulfillment of the desire of your flesh. Lust can be after money, gold, silver. Lust can be after murder. I lust to kill. I lust to murder. I lust to steal. Lust is not or just a male or female, whatever, desire to have each other. Lust is an apple, you see. So there are people that are lusting, separated from God after everything that the world has to offer their children. People are lusting to hurt other people. Desire to see people fall and one mind see people die. One mind seeing people dying. You funeral home directors, whatever you guys are, you undertakers, I'll be so glad when Satan is allowed by God to go ahead and give y'all so much business until your money that you are making will no longer be able to be used to buy you anything out of the store. You're not going to want to bury them when you got the mark of the beast. You're not going to want to bury them through a Bitcoin transaction. Your cash going to dry up, undertaker. And your dead people going to rise and y'all got to bury them for free. But every man is tempted when he is drawn away of his own lust and enticed. Which means the enemy build up the process. He dangles the carrots in front of you. We did not know and we see it now that America is in the great transitioning hour.
transformation hour. Every man is enticed, drawn away of his own desire. When a man desires to become a woman, he is lusting to become what he wasn't created to be. So the enemy feed him the desire and the yearning of wanting to be a woman when he's a man. In the last days, God will give them over to a strong delusion. Men with men, women with women, working that which is unseemly in the sight of the Lord. And now you cannot tell, and Hollywood has really covered it up, and there truly have been women uh, that were actually men playing Hollywood scenes and dress like women, look like women, and you never knew that they were little boys and men. This is the great deception that's taking place. <laughs> and here's the thing about it. I'm spotting this stuff now more than ever before. Look at the women on television, and you will find out that half of them are men. Y'all are in trouble. Then when lust have conceived, it bring forth sin, and sin when it is finished, bring it forth death. Verse number 15, the book of James, chapter number 1, verse number 16. Do not err, my beloved brethren. What does it do? It is conceived. Time to separate. The man become pregnant with the desire to become a woman. The woman become pregnant with the desire to lie, cheat, and steal, to work witchcraft. It is a desire to go out and to commit a sin that takes over the mind, the body. Now they're all talking about you know, the control systems, the, the old Delta 19 shot, COVID-19 shot, how these robots and these shots, and they call them whatever they call them, I don't know what they call these things, antibox or uh, mi microbots or whatever them things are, uh, autobots, transform. Transform a robot. What they stuck it inside of you. And you, I'm beginning to wonder about that stuff for real now, y'all. Because I'm a military man. And I've had every shot in the world. Test subject for the United States government, Natick, Massachusetts. Did the old man, young man test study. Walked in desert temperatures of 100 plus degrees for however many hundreds of thousands of miles that a human can walk until their body burned out inside, until their temperature overheated, until a, a, a cathode and a temperature is placed behind your heart and inside of your intestines to keep the temperature and regulate all the systems and monitor everything that we had to do and all of this and they're increasing and the lights are on and the sun is everywhere and it's heating and we're walking and we're walking and we're walking and we're burning and we're walking we're drinking water and walking and heat and death of temperatures and we're about to explode you see I'm wondering about the old 19 shot. Seems like some funny stuff happening in the body. Am I the first? 19, I'm concerned about you. You might be the first that Jesus said, they shall take up deadly poison, and this shall do them no harm. They shall take up serpents, and they will not be destroyed. 
Have we taken the serpent? If you've given me the deadly harm in the serpent, I can tell you one thing. Look for it because this brother got the right blood type. <laughs> Remember that. It's going to backfire. And if I find out, y'all through. Don't let me find out. I don't care nothing about your conspiracy theorists or what they say on your internet or your blogs or your whatever. I don't care about reading that junk. I'm going by how I feel. If I hear something or see something later, we come to get y'all, Jesus and I. Well, Prophet Johnson, no, I told y'all. I don't take every shot in the world, every shot on earth. I'm an ex-test subject for the United States government, but they're not going to tell y'all that. <laughs> I did the study. Okay, so be quiet and just listen, and let me get on through this. All right, praise the Lord. I have to say that and get that out of my system. But every good gift, uh, then when lust is conceived, it bringeth forth sin, it bringeth forth sin. Why? I don't have time to explain this. Y'all already know it. It takes, it, it develops it. You just don't go and commit adultery. You just don't go and start uh, lying, cheating, stealing. It's something that's conceived in you. It's, con it's in you. It's already there. Paul said the things that I would do. I don't do the things I would not do. I end up doing it's no longer I, but sin that dwelling in me. It's the sin nature. Uh, we can talk all the stuff you want. We all deserve hell. We've all sinned to come show out the glory of God. We all deserve to go to hell. Jesus got us all. Even your trapped children. Y'all got, don't y'all know y'all got trapped children now? That's right, trapped children. Children so smart, they lie and deceive and set traps. Oh, it's, it's sad. Y'all got trapped children. We got trapped children. Children know how to trap their parents through manipulating lying. And I get so tired. I'm going to tell you, I, I, I'm going to say this and move on. I get so tired of seeing these little f spoiled, fat. I mean, they, it would be different if they were skinny. But these are fat children. 10 years old and weigh 125 pounds. You see what I'm saying? And then, on top of that, get an attitude with their parents. But they love to eat all that hot pocket chemicals and whatever that stuff is y'all eat. I can't name that junk. But my point is this, America, your children are disobedient, disobedient, unthinkable. And I'm up there looking at the mother at the little rally trying to appease the little, the little girl and the little girl up there. We done stood up here all day to get in this rally to hear this hatred and racism and I want to have an attitude. And little mama said, you on camera, be happy, smile, laugh, and you're with the greatest hater in America. And I'm sitting there discerning all of this. Insane. You greedy, bunch of fat, chemical eating, hog wet, cheese nose picking. Bunch of folks that don't know we living in an in the end time, don't know we're in devastation, don't know this baby's about to break down. Y'all won't listen about the money. You won't listen about the food. You think this nation going to keep going like it is. You think everything going to keep going smooth like it is. With Harris. And Trump? Are y'all crazy? Y'all better wake up. And let's 
listen to it. Holy Spirit, God forgive me. I'm off. I got to share while I'm on here because I won't have no peace enough. I do. Listen to all the stuff that the sister is saying now about helping America. Uh, uh, talking about inflation. Talking about tax credit for the, for the children. Uh, talking all of it now uh, for the house. What was inflation at three years ago? What was it at two years ago when I told y'all that they was going to get every damned because it's a damned dime from the damnation of hell. Remember, they had, I don't have time to explain that to you backward, upside down Christians. We told y'all. Now they're up talking. Oh, inflation. <laughs> inflation. You're talking about it now? We're damned for a dime, for a thing, for an ass, a donkey, and there's not one damn thing you can do about being a jack for that dime. Because that's what we all are, a bunch of jack. For that, that, listen to them lies. Listen to them lies. Sound just like 44. Yes, we can. Became, oh no, hell, we didn't. Great and swelling words. Great and swelling words. And then on top of that, you already know 45. It's just. God, God help us. I might vote for him because he ain't going to get no vote. I already told y'all that's my last time. I'm not voting no more anyway. Might vote for 45 because he ain't going to win. Might vote for him just to raise hell, destroy the nation. Either way, go with damned if we do. By the Antichrist, with, 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 with the sister, and we, we damned that we do. If, if we don't, uh, with 45, with Russia and all the, we're damned if we do and we're damned if we don't. But y'all ain't listening. Uh, uh, that's right, minister, I'm riding this. And, and you, can, you, you ain't saving nothing. You're not listening. You're not preparing. You think that chicken going to stay in that stove. I done told y'all these people are getting these weapons to kill a certain species of mankind. Black people killing each other up. Satan using black people in the last days to destroy each other in the church. They using them on the internet to kill each other. They using them black people to bring in the last days the evil of the Antichrist. Why use the black man for homosexuality? Why use the black woman to kill babies and to bring in lesbianism? Why didn't y'all use these white people? Why y'all got to go use these black people? Because black people have been ignorant. They have been led astray, rebellious, stubborn, stiff-necked. Prophets, prophetess, calling each other liars, all on the internet, killing each other, damning each other cursing each other, dare anybody to curse them, thinking they holy, thinking they religion right, thinking they know all about God, all about dreams and visions and revelation and Enoch, Nephiliums, lost books of the Bible. They are just as all done for. And y'all know what? I'm closing right here. I'm closing right here, minister. Let me close it. Every good gift and every perfect gift is from above and cometh down from the Father of lights 
Do you see that every blessing you get come from God? Every talent, every gift. We know about the rappers and Beyonce and satanic order and worship and the boule and the... Y'all come on here, Illuminati. That's God help y'all. I'm closing, minister. With whom is no variableness, neither shadow, shadow of turnage. This is the last, last verse. Of his own will begat he us with the word of truth. With what? The word of truth. Last verse. This is it. That we should be a kind of what? First fruits of his creatures. That's supposed to be you and I. Folks, that's my time. I know it's been rough. It's popping. But nevertheless, all is well. The devil is a liar. You belong to Christ, and the best is yet to come. Just getting back. We're climaxing this week. I'll see you guys tomorrow night. Y'all have a good night. Bye.